In this video, I'm going to share with you six niche ideas that you can be designing for to get more sales in August. So the first niche I've got for you is back to school. This is probably one you should prioritize because it is coming up fairly soon. I think the back to school date for the US is the 1st of August, as far as I'm aware. And um, while this is a very big niche, there is plenty of sub niche opportunity, almost endless sub niche opportunity when you're going into this. So the first row of results shows that there's already lots of low BSRs, considering we're still a few weeks out from this actually happening. One way or the obvious way to sub a niche in this is targeting different grades. So these shirts say third grade, this one is for second graders, and then also you get the one saying I'm going to crush kindergarten. So different sort of levels of school that people might be moving into. Other sort of sub niche or cross niche ideas is obviously we've got dinosaurs right here. That's something that boys would be very interested in. You could think of similar ideas for girls, maybe unicorns would work well for a sort of more girly type of design. The rainbow theme is also quite popular for female niches. So that would be a good idea in terms of design styles. But just thinking of even just other types of people that are going back to school rather than kids could be very useful here. So we've got this teacher design, which is quite cool, it stands out. It's on a white t-shirt. It has that leopard print on this lightning in the background, which is really cool. So it's teachers going back to school as well. Then you'll probably have janitors or custodians also will have had some time off from school and will be coming back so maybe you could target those too just to give you another idea just thinking of different hobbies and interests to do with children like this one right here gaming is another good way to go about this lots of boys and girls will be spending a lot of time gaming during summer then when they come back to school they might want to have a gaming themed design to represent that fact but you could even have shirts that are just somewhat school themed don't have necessarily anything to do with going back to school just adding that term in the title like this one right here could pick up some extra sales or could help you pick up some extra sales during the back to school period try and be creative and target some different sub niches for back to school so moving on to the second niche we've got bowling and you might be wondering why bowling in august that seems a bit random but there is actually a reason for this and it's the fact that the National Bowling Day is on the 13th of August this year. And that's why there will probably be an influx of interest within this niche. And there's also already quite a few designs selling quite well. So I definitely would stay away from ripping off the Star Wars logo right there, Spare Wars. That's a very dangerous tactic, at least if you want to keep your account alive. Different variations right here of bowling designs that you could try out. Do find inspiration on other marketplaces as well. So I'd go ahead and look on Etsy, Redbubble, TeePublic, see what's out there and what might not be on Amazon and just try and come and come up with some ideas that way. One thing I can definitely recommend here is including the phrase National Bowling Day in your, well, either in your title or at least in your listing somewhere in the description because the results are extremely low for this term. And uh, when it comes closer to National Bowling Day, I'm pretty sure people will actually search for this specific phrase because they'll want to wear a, a t-shirt specifically designed for that national holiday while they're going out bowling. So if you include this term, you could be among these search results, which have a lot less competition and uh, try and pick up some easy sales that way. And then uh, throughout the rest of the year, you will be able to collect some more sales in the general bowling niche because you've managed to pick up sales during this specific holiday by including that search term. Next up, we've got fantasy football. And the reason for this is because football season is starting again in August and I didn't want to recommend football because it's a massive niche. However, fantasy football is a sub niche that could be uh, very beneficial to some of you. So basically, if you're thinking about designing for this, while scrolling through this, I noticed you'll have to either make designs for people who really suck at fantasy football. Like this t-shirt is like sort of an embarrassing thing for someone to wear who, who's bad at the game, I suppose. 
Um, but then there's also these ones like this guy is a fantasy football legend that are sort of praising the person for being really good. So that's two approaches that seem to work very well. Some of these designs are generally just football themed, so sort of going after a broader niche. However, if you scroll through this a bit, you'll see different specific fantasy football designs that do quite well. Yeah, you definitely see the unicorn theme quite a bit. Eat, sleep, fantasy football, repeat. Very basic text design and it's doing fairly well already whilst the like official fantasy football season doesn't start for I think like a, another three four weeks so yeah definitely one to look out for a cool sub niche potentially a very funny sub niche to design for for this August so have fun with this one do your research and I'm sure you can pick up some sales so next up we've got niche number four and it is popsicles or popsicle and this is uh, more of a general summer niche but it could still be doing really well in august while it's still hot uh, there's quite a few designs here with very low bsrs and they also just look really really nice these graphics on the t-shirts something people would definitely want to wear while they're spending time out during summer i really like this one as well on the white one which is by detour shirts which some of you might know from youtube uh, this is one of his designs so a very cool one there indeed not maybe tons and tons of shirts with extremely low bsrs but it's a fairly small niche if you find some nice preset graphics or maybe you you're talented enough to design some of these yourself then yeah you can definitely create some cool designs for this think of some different phrases as well to try and use along this or maybe even cross niching in some different ways as well and niche number five is elephants. This is because it is World Elephant Day on the 12th of August, meaning there will definitely be an increase in interest in terms of elephant t-shirts or just elephant themed things in general so this is definitely a niche to consider a lot of designs that seem to be doing well have sort of a family theme among it so um, either like a parent elephant with a baby or an entire family like this one right here but obviously that's not the only style that you can design for elephants also often get used in conjunction with the be kind phrase which I definitely noticed while doing my research. And you also get quite a few of these mandala designs, which look really cool, probably quite hard to create, but I could see them doing especially well during World Elephant Day, because they're sort of artsy and uh, yeah, just representing elephants in general. But just do have a look at this niche, see what sort of ideas you can come up with. Maybe there's also cross niche and sub niche opportunities right here that'll make it easier for you to stand out. One would be this one. I've seen actually a handful of these as well. Gender reveal type of designs with elephants, which is quite a cool, unique idea. And it seems to be doing quite well. So yeah, there's a few ideas for you of how to try and tag this niche four weeks from now. This niche will be very popular so uh, if you want to get some extra sales start designing right now get your designs up early and be ready for this national elephant day and niche number six today we've got whale shark and this is for something that's happening a bit later in august on the 30th to be exact it is international whale shark day and whale sharks don't seem, seem to be too popular all year round i mean there's a few general shark designs mixed in here but if we scroll down um, to the actual whale shark designs like this one right here the bsrs are a bit higher but it is a smaller niche there's definitely not much um, sort of choice out there in terms of whale shark designs at the end of august there will be an influx and interest for these animals so definitely one with sort of lower competition that you might want to try and put some designs up for and once again if you actually type in the phrase international whale shark day you only get 90 results back so people will be looking for this on the day or near to the day and then there was very very little competition so do try this one out upload it to other marketplaces as well definitely a cool opportunity lower competition and a very interesting animal to create designs for i hope you enjoyed this video and you have fun designing and if you want to find some great quality niches yourself then i recommend you watch this video next where i show you five ways to find evergreen niches that sell mm -hmm.